Blood Paths is a cycle of new works by 25 Australian composers for solo piano with solo dancer. The creative aim of Blood Paths is to celebrate the multiculturalism that pervades the Australian art scene, and it seeks to pose an abstract answer to the unanswerable question of what it sounds like, what it looks like, and what it means to be an Australian artist in contemporary society. I feel really privileged to be working closely with dancer and choreographer Katina Olsen on this project. Katina is one of Australia's leading freelance contemporary dancers with an extensive background of experience working with Sydney Dance Company, Bangara Dance Theatre and Expressions Dance Company. I'm Katina Olsen, I'm a Waka Waka Kumba Mary dancer and choreographer and in my practice in choreographing works uh, it's mainly focused on drawing from my family stories um, through Waka Waka and Kumbaba Mary dreaming stories so to work on blood paths is really special in that I'm able to translate these stories from the composers through movement and that's been a really special journey. It's quite dark in a way, or, or maybe a bit pessimistic because the, the, the devil is in a way taking over the beautiful ballerina at the end. And it ends with uh, a, a very soft ending with the low end of the piano. So there is a sort of a crescendo and it goes very loud all over the range of the piano. And it ends very, very dark where the devil's taking over. The team of composers for Blood Parts includes Lyle Chan, Jared Brophy, Lachlan Skipworth, David Chisholm, Elliot Geiger, Kat Hope, Kate Moore, Damian Rickardson, Austin Bucket, Lisa Cheney, Paul Dean, Connor Donetto, Pedro Alvarez, Yitzhak Yedid, Alex Pozniak, Michael Bakrenchev, Jacob Bragg, Benjamin Marks, Jody Roddle, John Rotar, Heidi Chan, Peter Ziega, Jasmine Leung, Elaine Sito, and finally a work from myself.